Emi Akiritsugu, probably my favorite character of this show so far. His techniques, his whole philosophy, his attitude towards everything. You could say it's very shady, it's underhanded, and absolutely it is, because we're here to win. And the contrast with his servant, Saber, we are not seeing eye to eye to the point where their chivalry is literally getting in our way. Like, Lancer protected Kaneth even though we could have finished them because Saber let him get away. And I know the whole Knight's Code. I get it. I understand. But I feel like we need to have a conversation. Something needs to be communicated so that we can work together. Is, is there a compromise that we can meet? I'm not too sure. Kiri seems to be very convinced that Kiritsuku must be liking because he wants to relate to somebody. He wants to know that he's not alone in this world. That I'm not, this, I'm not this like empty ghoul that I must have some sort of pleasure, some sort of reason for existing. Maybe Kiritsuku is going to give it to me. I don't know. Also, wonder exactly how many bullets Kiritsuku has left. The origin bullet, 66 of them. We used one, but I'm, I'm going to assume he's used them in the past. Maybe they'll just keep it like a mystery count so that it seems like we have an unlimited amount. Let's begin today's reaction. I subscribe to you on Patreon. Hopefully, you will not ban me anymore. I don't think you're getting the point, bro. Paying money, trying to get special privileges, none of that shit matters. You're missing the point. For that reason, I will send you on a vacation. And I hope you will understand. All you have to do is just enjoy the video and fuck off, alright? Paying money for special privileges, don't do that shit. There's a value proposition on Patreon, and you're either compelled by the content or not. Trying to fucking say shit like that will just get you closer to being banned, okay? Just enjoy the content, that's all you have to do. Lancer? Lancer backstory. Oh, she's thirsty for him. <laughs> it's, that's that mole, bro. It's this charm, bro. He's slain all the ladies. Yeah, she's down bad for him. Oh my god. Yo, yo, is, is Dearmu... Is she cheating on the king? Because that was like the whole... I, 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 it's, it's, that's the same girl, right? It seems like this is some sort of arranged marriage. I don't know. The, the wife is super down bad for deer mood. They're like cheating on the ruler here. Uh oh. We got set up! We got set up! Wait, did deer mood not know that the girl was like the king's? Hold up. Like, was he complete? How, how could you be unaware that whole ceremony was there? So, like, Deer Mood willingly home wrecked the king. And the king is like, all right, you guys are traitors. You fucked my wife. Right? Is that what's going on here? So, he, he knew. He had to know. How would you not know? So, <laughs> well, can we really say this is like. Oh, let's go, Dear Mood, L King. I, I don't know. If I was the king and that shit happened, I'd be like... I mean, shit. I don't blame him. Oh? Somehow they were saved? Dear Mood, like, beat off the king's soldiers or some shit? It seems like we, we, we are officially married now and everything's good? Wait. Okay, it was a setup. Okay, this this motherfucker. Okay, so I still like shitty for sure. But do you blame him? Like he fucked his wife and ran away and got married. It's like 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 like. Do you blame this guy? Like it's not as Dear Moon is completely innocent. He he willingly fucked his wife and ran away and married. Like I do not blame him. <laughs> Kaneth. Okay, Kaneth you. can't use magic anymore, right? Why did why did Kaneth have Lancer's dreams? But that was because the connection with master and servant, but it, master servant dreams is a real thing? So Kiritsugo will have dreams about Saber? Interesting. 
Lesson to Deer Mood. Pretty funny legend. <laughs> what is the lesson to Deer Mood? <laughs> that he fucked the king's wife then died for his sins? <laughs> wife. He's all restrained? Yo, wife, what are you doing? What's happening? Wait, wait, he got hit by the origin bullet. Supposedly, he can't use magic circuits anymore and won't even be really a human. His wife? What's the wife doing? Yo, Diermut? Yeah, Diermut should fuck Kanus' wife. <laughs> de de yes, Diermut de should fuck Kanus' wife. <laughs> Don't matter, baby. Origin bullet. Your body's done. You're not a mage anymore. Yeah. Regen. So she is helping him, okay? I thought that she was doing something honest. That's like a fate worse than death for him, right? Like his entire reason for existing, his entire like value system is based on his pride as a mage. He feels superior. His entire reason for existing is, I'm a mage, I'm better than you. But now it's just like, what are you, bro? What are you? Yeah? I mean, that's true. We got Deer Mood. He got command spells too. True. <laughs> His wish is to fix himself. True? We got two more command spells. Do you think Solawi would win and then wish for Kanith as recovery? I don't think so. I think that dream is literally happening right now. I think he's literally getting cucked. I think, I think the wife is literally leaving him with nothing. Give me the command spells, bro. I'm gonna go fuck Diermud. Bye. Nah, dude. <laughs> I do not trust her. Especially because you're marrying us to the Archibald family. I feel like you've just been... I don't think she loves Kaneth at all. I think that she's an incredibly vicious, cunning businesswoman just trying to marry into the Archibald family and take everything for its god and right now is the most opportune time to just take Kaneth to shit and leave. Yeah, 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 yeah. So they already fucked. You say what Yeah. 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 He doesn't seek the grail? Maybe he's just here to fuck women and leave. Or he's just here for knightly duels and knight chivalry. I don't think you're really in the position to order that. <laughs> Do you understand the position you're in? How do you get the command spells? How do you, how do you, how, 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 how do you get those tattoos back on here? How does that work? Ah. 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 The sound? <laughs> 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 this woman is a demon. Yeah, I'll have to force myself to do it. I'll skin you alive. Yeah, she's definitely gonna win the grail for us. And then she's definitely going to fucking save us, guys. 100%. I feel like I can trust this woman, man. You know what? Kire is right. Where's Kire right now? Onna. Woman! <laughs> Yo, Kire needs to show up out of nowhere and just... Whoosh! Maya. I think the reason Kaneth couldn't use his command spell to order Lancer to kill his wife 
is because he's such a weak man that submits under her still. Like, he can't bring himself to do it. I mean, you've seen the dynamic when they were talking too, right? Like, she's like a predator, like, just hawking over him. He's just, like, can't even make eye contact. He's, like, looking down at the ground. I don't think he can do it, bro. You think Kiritsugu cares about that? You, you, you think Kiritsugu would go out there and, 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 and risk his position to save these innocent children? If they die, then they can't cry anymore, right? Dreams and ideals. Then so be it. Use Maya. Damn, doesn't even ask. Is Maya fine? How long until we can use Maya again? Oh, he's going in! He's going in! Yo, he's going for the kill! Kiritsugu's going for the kill! Oh, that bluff. Probably. I'd be pissed. <laughs> That's right. For the greater goal, a few sacrifices must be made. A few dozen? It is what it is. Hmm. Exactly. Liabilities, bro. Like, Saber fucked up. That was such a big liability. Sure, it worked out. But what if it didn't? That... Like 0.1% chance. The, the, the fact that that was still there, like, nah, man. We, we can't be doing that shit. We gotta be way more tight with this. Kirisuku's mad. Nansa, Hello. He... Not good. I'm your master now. She got the spells. I'm your master now. <laughs> Blames it on Kaneth. Doesn't even blame on Kiritsugu. Yo, that Kiritsugu is too strong. No, it's, she's just, yeah, my husband fucking sucks. <laughs> okay. Oh, nah. Yeah. Is this bro? <laughs> Man, dear, I feel bad for this guy because he's just like too hot and being too hot is like his downfall, like his entire life. It's because of this goddamn mole. All these girls just fought after him and it's just like he died because of that shit. So even now, like this is probably going to be his downfall. Yeah. ケネスとの日記師として忠誠を誓ったみたいです。その申し出は承諾的。そう、ウィドゼンワンコンセント。私の魔力によって限界している。サーバーだろ。That's <laughs>私が私の目を見て話して。Uh-oh. Oh, smart one. Okay, okay. This is way smarter than just using a command spell. Okay, now gaslight him and give him the hope there. Yeah. True. Oh, you wicked Onna. <laughs> Woman, you are twisted. Smart though. I respect this. Mm. Peak manipulation. Let's go. That was great. To say what you will about her character, that was like the objective best play. Completely reversing it onto his fault. 
if you have a knight's code of honor, then you will do this. I don't even need to use my, you know, command spell right now. That was good. <laughs> あなたは経営のスタッフの伴侶として平和を求めるのか。そうしたら。そう。だとは言えない。キャ。夫に聖杯を捧げます。ライアー。オールライト。ライアー。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。ありがとう。あり
right? It's just like adapting to modern society, <laughs> watching TV, ordering off Amazon, hanging out with the grandparents. I love it. <laughs> That's such a barbaric way of eating. It might as well be a fork, bro. <laughs> We got pants now. Nice. Alexi. Alexander. Iskander. Weaver's not having it. Oh, this is Alright. My man's conquering this household. <laughs> this cup is so fucking big too, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, it's a lot of it. What? Water? What's he doing? Science experiments? The hell? He's coded them all. And letters. Pretending? <laughs> I'm gonna assume this is somehow tracking Ryunosuke and Caster and the murder shit they're doing? I don't know. It was all like water shit they're tracking. Is there like blood in the water? Like, what are we tracking? Unless it's the fights that we did near the water, but that was like a port. I don't know. I feel like this has to be somehow related to Caster, though. Yeah, how did you know? Smart. Oh, 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 cute. Oh, oh, we got it, we got it. <laughs> Bro went and sampled water and just tested this shit and magic residue and the one Q1 that was blank, that was the one and that's where he's doing it. That's the home base? Something? He is. He is. Oh. I think still think he's smart. No, that, was, that was sincere genius. True. Complexity, it's all just noise. Simplicity is beautiful. Okay. Okay. わかってる。わかってない。で、最強のアドバンテージを誇ってるんだ。I don't know if he's proud or if he's gaslighting Waver and it's an excuse to go find some action. I'm not really sure. Maybe a little bit of both. What's in there? More children sacrifice? What's in there, bro? Yeah, these are all kids, right? I don't know. <laughs> he's doing his thing. <laughs> Children sacrifices. Uh oh. You want to turn the light on right now? You want to see all the horrors in here? Some... Wait, are you sure about this? Mm. <laughs> Oh, he stepped in that. That was blood squirt right there. Children blood on his clothing, I think. Yeah. Ooh. Does it not smell? Ooh. 
I guess their ventilation system here is so well done that they couldn't even smell the corpses. He was just trying to protect you there. <laughs> Kiritsugu probably wouldn't blink an eye at this too. Yeah. I mean, he's a conqueror. He's seen some shit too, right? It's time for action. Dagger. Assassins. Secrets out. So dark in here, man. I can't see shit. Alright, uh, their demise. Multiple assassins. Kire communicated the line in the beginning. You're gonna fucking leech right dead. Dude, I swear to god, these assassins are dumb as fuck. There's been multiple times they just show up and just like leak the resistance and don't even do anything and run away. Like, like, what was the point of that? <laughs> and there were some other times too in the past too, but like, maybe it's not part of the plan. Maybe we're dumb. Listen, let them cook. Let them cook, bro. B maybe this is some giga brain play where now we're expecting that he's alive, but I, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, hundred. The darkness. I should get out of here. What is Caster planning? Wait, so, all the children, corpses, sacrifices. I mean, they're all dead. We're just getting rid of the trash right now. Damn. Imagine the fucking smell here, man. Holy, this is a mass cremation. Waver, you're now a man. No longer a boy. Some disturbing sights. Why didn't he go... Yo. He, he, he should've... Done the war chant as he just cremated all the fucking children here. Alright, we fucked up their base. Oh,私のも相当いい話じゃないさ。じゃあ、わかったから、やめろそれ。引き上げるぞ。<笑> Man, their relationship is so nice. Waver and Ryder. The beginning was a bit shaky, I guess. Kind of. With the whole... I, I don't know. It feels like he's just like teaching him how to be a man. Waver just like... This is like the greatest lesson of life he'll get. Ryder just feels like he's just teaching Waver how to become a proper man. Like a big brother, mentor figure. I was initially a little bit... Hesitant about their dynamic because of how different they were, but it's actually working out real nicely. Kirei and Assassin, there's not really much there. They're all just doing shadowy shit. Tokiomi... Tokiomi and Gilgamesh is the most passive-aggressive, hostile shit ever. <laughs> Tokiomi just is like, my lord. But deep inside, he's probably like, this fucking idiot thinks that he's beyond me. And then Gilgamesh just thinks he's boring. What else is there? Saber, Kiritsugu, that's the worst combo, right? They do not see eye to eye. Cast every Onosuke, they're, they're on point. They're very on point. Who else is there? Lancer, Kanith. <laughs> Lancer's just fucking his wife now. Yeah, Kanith this calendar would've been so weird. If Ryunosuke and Ryder would've happened, I wonder if Ryder could've redeemed Ryunosuke. Just like changed his entire being and went from serial killer to like proper citizen. I don't know. Alright, they got intel, they got intel. <laughs> Don't kill me. <laughs> to the Tosakas. Waver is the third rate maids. 
Okay, I mean, I guess they got some intel, huh? They wanted to see, like, Ryder's, like, secret weapon or some shit, but alright. It's not like the assassins did nothing. Tokyo is not leaving this room, bro. <laughs> he is never leaving this room. <laughs> you know what the funniest shit? <laughs> Tokimi camps this shit for like 20 plus episodes and the moment he leaves is the moment he dies or something. That would be so fucking funny. He's like trying to be so cautious, so careful, so many spies, so many teammates just camping, camping. He sets one step outside, he needs to go bang. Hmm? <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 This is important dialogue. Hold up. Had they not been discovered, other options. Okay, this is kind of telling me that Kiri is starting to think a little bit more independently. Right? Because Tokyo is like, yo, stick to the script. You don't have to do anything special. Kiri, I think, is starting to be a little bit more independent. Starting to realize his desires, maybe. Elegance? Fuck elegance, bro. Result is all that matters. Gilgamesh has completely corrupted Kire, bro. That whole meeting was the worst thing that could have happened for Tokiomi. Kire has just been... Remember, homeschool kid is now smoking weed. Yep. Good, good old Christian homeschool kid is now smoking the Zaza. Uh oh, he's gonna rebel now. My teacher. Okay. That was ominous. That was very ominous there from Kide. I think these are the first steps to show that Kide's. Maybe gonna find something for himself. Maybe he won't just sit around and listen to Tokyo me because he finds the shit a little bit too fucking boring. Today's episode started off with a sad but kind of funny backstory for Lancer. Due to his curse or blessing, his fucking charm, all the girls just want him and just led to his demise. He knowingly fucked the king's wife. Maybe the king's wife seduced him and i don't know it was more context involved but i understand why the king would feel like that and now with kanan and you know salaui it's, it's kind of the same shit too kiritsugu is mad though and he's coming for them lancer just wants that loyalty that was never there in his past life right he's such an honorable guy i feel so fucking bad but everyone else around is such a piece of shit lancer this is like not your era man this is the era of fucking sociopaths and backstabbers. You're too good for this place, man. Saber as well. Saber's dialogue is kind of interesting about how if Kanis and Kirisuku didn't fight, that we could have defeated, you know, Caster. But it's a little bit unfair because Kanis just like invaded us from the beginning. Now, he invaded us because we fucking blew up the building. But still, I don't know. It's, it's interesting to see how, even though Kirisuku is right, I totally see how Saber could have been right too, right? There's not like a right answer. There's different ways to solve shit. There's more than one solution. It's just what kind of like mentality you have. Looking like we busted up Caster's home base. They weren't there. I'm not sure where they are. Maybe they're out shopping right now. Doing some fun shit. They come home and the home base is all messed up. Maybe Caster's gonna get smoked out. They'll be in public and Ryder's kind of waiting for that. And then Kirei Tokiomi Gilgamesh shit. Kirei's changing. He definitely is. He's not just this goody two-shoes kid that's just listening to orders anymore. Something is changing within him and I can't wait to see how much he develops. That's it for me. If you're still here though, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.